War out, folks! Tomorrow let's play Final Fantasy X, the 60th episode of the Let's Play. To put that in proportion, the most amount of parts I've ever done in Let's Play, I believe, is 54. So, yeah, episode number 60! Go drumsticks! There's no one that I would rather spend this with than my good old pal drumsticks. Alright, so I'm going to carry on the story now. There are a lot of side quests you can do here. But I will be doing that probably at some point. Like, for example, there's a, an entrance over there. Uh, I'm going to leave all those, and I'm going to be doing, like, sort of a side quest montage probably later on. Uh, so that's what I'll be doing, because for the moment, I just want to advance the story. Uh, yeah. So, let's carry on. Go, drumsticks! I believe you can actually use... Oh, no, wait, you can't. Okay. I wonder if you could use your chocobo, like, anywhere to get to places a bit quicker. Sure hope so, because that would be great for backtracking and getting stuff. Because obviously you're going to have to do a lot of backtracking. Alright, safe sphere. Hmm, lovely. Is there anything over here? No. And nope. Alright, bridge crossing. Easy. Halt. Don't you dare tell me just off oh, of God's sakes. Summons it's... from Lord Seymour. Come with us. Is he not dead yet? We have nothing to discuss with Maester Seymour. Yeah, he's a knob. Defense. Yeah, so out of our way. Lord Seymour's commands must be obeyed. You will come. I will come and kick your ass in a minute. Maester doesn't need you alive. We don't need you alive, so I recommend you leave before I push you off that cliff. Oh. I believe the Guado bought back up. Ah. Oh my god, it's the ancient gear golem! Was, was that a good Dr. Crowler impression? Oh, I'm gonna say it is. Anyway, carrying on. It's this thing with a lot of bloody health. It's Defender X. It's made of stone. Resistant to physical attacks. That sucks, because we are a completely physical team. But, first I'm going to hastigar every single person. You Guado are not gonna get away with this. You know that, right? First off, the Waxter is going to dark bust its face. Get busted in darkness. Blast punch. Okay. Ah. Okay. Let's see, I believe you now about that. What do we give now? Alright, armor break. Are you resistant, are you? We'll see about that. Yeah, we'll see what you're like now. Man, it's quick! I'll tell you what. For us having Hastigar, it's bloody quick. Well, to get a sh ooh, maybe does it get a shot off every time we hit it? Possibly. Is it weak to anything? Is it weak to any element? No, all right, I'm just gonna go for three then. Come on, Walker, give me a three. Papa needs a new pair of shoes. Water. Yeah, I got it right. Three waters. You can tell from my Yugi uh, Duels of the Roses Let's Play, I'm not very good at reels. But that worked! Kicked in the face! Oren, shooting star time. You need to take this guy out. Not bad. Boom! More damage. See how you Guado bastards deal with this. Ow, you punch Oren in the face. That must have hurt. Okay. What if I can... Mm. Let's try and silence it, shall we? See what that does. Bang! Up, oh, it's immune to it. All right, and slice and dice time, Titus. It's your turn. I did not do that as well as I wanted to, but we'll see how much damage we can get off. It's a good start of damage. Ooh, that's a lot of damage there. He's down already a third his health. Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. Damn it. Okay, well, Titus hit him. Boom. Yeah, he gets a shot off every time we hit him. Ow. Okay. What are we going to do about it then? 
I could bring a Bahamut, actually, couldn't I? Is he healed yet? Sure hope so. Yeah. All right, Bahamut! Come on out and kill this bastard. You can't kill what won't die. And Bahamut is the guy who you will not kill. Because look at him! Do you think you can kill him now, Defender X? You are nothing in comparison to Bahamut. Bahamut, Wateraga! Let's kick him in the face with water! Wow, that did pretty much nothing. And you punch Bahamut in the face. All right, well, returning kind. Punch him in the face. Yeah, have some. Haymaker. Oh, God! Bahamut is dead. No, Bahamut! No, why? Damn it, you bastard! How dare you! How dare you indeed! Ugh. What am I gonna do now? Well, first, Titus needs a heal. Titus needs a heal. I'm gonna have to use a potion on Mr. Titus. Heal, Titus! It's Walker's turn again. What can I do here? I could aim. I could drain. Or I could just keep using items. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use aim here for no reason. Aim. Increase our power. So yeah, he gets a shot off. Oh, it's Waka's turn again? Oh, for God's sake. Well, he gets a shot off every time, pretty much. So, I'm just going to start healing my team. So, Titus, you're getting healed again. That's kind of good, to be honest, because then you can just come in with, like, a full frontal assault. What if I can delay him? Let's try and delay him. Delay Buster! Oh, he's immune to the delay. And he's going to get shot off with a blast punch. Which, if he hits Walker, he's probably going to kill him. Nobody hits Titus. You know, it's time for you to summon someone else. I believe Shiva. Let's go for Shiva, shall we? What I kind of want is just for someone to survive the onslaught so they can get an overdrive off. That would be great. It would deal a fair amount of damage. So you have a cheer and an aim. I could cheer, couldn't I? Alright, let's Blizzara ourself. Just to get our overdrive meter up a bit. And it didn't even increase our overdrive, okay? And we're gonna get punched in the face. Right! Right. Shiva survived. You're getting diamond dusted. Click. Bang. Take that, ya bastard. And you're going to punch Shiva in the face. No, Shiva! Alright, that's two down, but Shiva did her work. She did her damage. Well done, Shiva. Unlike Bahamut, Bahamut didn't do any bloody damage. Anyway, we'll carry on. Come on, team. He's nearly dead, in fact. But we need to heal. That is the big problem here. Titus needs healing for a kickoff. Heal Titus. And Waka, while you're at it, heal yourself. Heal yourself! Alright, so the Aeons have helped me out a bit. Not much, but a bit. Oh, no, we don't need a Phoenix down. Uh, one more on Titus. Alright, Yuna, we're swapping you out. Auron's coming back in. Alright, Auron. Power break him. Power break! Just in case he punched us in the face! Oh, he didn't go for the shot. He's going to now. Yep, blast punch coming up. Who's he gonna hit? He's hitting Walker! That's not good. Mighty Guard. Oh god. What has he done? He's got Shell, Protect, Null Tide. Oh god! That is a dangerous move! God, he's immune to pretty much every shot. Oh wait, I know why. I know, I know exactly why. It's because I have Water Strike, isn't it? So let's change the Deathbringer, shall we? There we go, more damage coming up. Blast Punch again. This guy is probably the toughest opponent we've fought so far. It's a bit of a dangerous bastard. Right, High Potion. We need to get Auron back to strength. I could use Riku's uh, abilities here, which could be useful, actually. But uh, I'm not going to. He's going to punch Titus in the face. 
Ty's gonna fight back with death! You're immune to death! That's not good. What's also not good is you may actually kill Titus. You don't kill Titus! Ooh, does Blast Punch only do half damage? It'd be useful if it only does half damage. Waka, attack again! Oh, critted! Have some! Have some crit in your face! Yeah, it only does half damage! Alright, wait a minute. I don't think I've got a problem then, really, do I? Unless for his haymaker shot, he's gonna hit Oren. Okay. Okay. How much health has it got? Oh, of course we can't see. Uh, Oren, you need to come back, buddy. We need. We can't do this without you. Come back, Oren. Come back. Right. Titus, attack. He's gotta be nearly dead. He has to be nearly dead. And you blast punch me. Well, I'm gonna hit you in the face with a ball. Boom. We're getting some damage off here. That is good. He's gonna keep blast punching, but it's pretty much like a slightly powered up Demi, so it's not actually gonna do that much damage, luckily. He is probably gonna haymaker someone and kill him. Oh, like an attempt on Oren's life. So that's fine. Ty's gonna get a shot off. And then Oren's gonna get a shot off. Come on, Oren. Yeah! I'm just going like full pelt power shot here. Gonna hit Oren. That's fine, because Oren and Waka both get healing. It's only Waka, that, it's only Titus that doesn't. So you could you could attack Waka and Oren as much as you want. Yep, yep, go on, go on. He's just gonna heal himself, you know, you dumbass. No, not Oren again! Damn it. Alright. Phoenix down one more time. It's good thing I got a lot of these. Oren, you need to come back, buddy. Welcome back. I'm probably playing this completely wrong. But uh, never mind. Titus, I think we got him there. Oh, we did. Defender X. Defeated X. Dead X. Screwed X. Owned X. Have I just owned? Level 2 key sphere. Nice. Could be useful at some point. So, um, Defender X, uh, how did that work for you? First thing you're going to do is I'm going to uh, heal, because I kind of need to. So, crossing over the bridge, just to heal. Yeah, healing. Tastes like healing. So, uh, Mr. Guados, how do you feel now? Ah, oh, they've run away. What wusses. And there's nothing over here. Okay, I'm just checking for treasure chests. Just in case. Ooh, there's a way we can make it over this way. I think. This isn't the way in. That way or not. Down into the valley. Oh god, at least to Wales? Huh? Yeah, apparently, Walker. So that's not the way to go, I guess. Guess we don't need to go down the valleys. We need to go this way. I'm guessing. I have gotten this far before, but it's been a long time since I have. As I said, I've never completed this game before, but I have gotten close, very close. I think the first I've got is Zanakin. So yeah. Anyway. To be honest, Yuna, that bridge isn't the safest of looking things. You might as well want to step off. Sometimes Yuna would just stare off into the distance. Yes, wondering why the hell the Guado's infatuated with her. It is not in a woman's life where she is supposed to be hounded and, uh, and harassed by Guado men. She was saying goodbye to the places she'd never see again. She said goodbye to Seymour twice, and the, for some reason the bastard keeps coming back. Seriously, orders from Seymour. I thought we killed him again. But apparently we haven't. He's still alive. Again. Anyway, we're moving on. Ooh, the Zanakin ruins. Well, we're not there yet, so hold your horses, game. We're, uh, we're not in the ruins just yet. We still have a little way to go to get to the ruins, so... Let's keep on moving on up, moving on up. There's a safe sphere as well. Right, we're all here now. Great. 
Hello, Kimari. Oh god, it's this bit. I remember this bit now. Ah, oh, crap. This is bad. Hello, Biran, I think. And other guy. Keelik. Oh, wait, that's not Biran. That's another guy. We are surrounded by the Ronso, though. will not bear the footsteps of infidels. Sorry, one of your guards is wearing a thong. Oh, it is Biren. Yeah. Biren's wearing a thong, so I can't take him seriously. I have cast aside Yevon. I, I follow the temple no more. Then you will die by those words. What's going to make us? You weird... Lino looking all. people. Nothing but a bunch of low down tricksters, eh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Good thing Walker's got his uh, newly no atheism way. fan club in the background there. Class, Trust me, you guys don't stand a chance against the Aeons. Oh. Kimari, why? You not also turned your back on Bavel? But still, you guard Gagazet as a Ronso, not a Maester. Yuna is much the same. Uh, Elder Kelk! Let Biran ran them asunder! Nice try, Biran, but you wear thong. Not one. No, Wearing no, thong no. loses masculinity. We will fight and continue. Makes you look kind of shit. You have been branded a traitor, but still you would fight sin. Trust me, what they've got in store for you. By the people, yet you continue your pilgrimage. What we want to do is nothing. What do you fight for? We fight for justice and peace. And we also fight because Biran's wearing a thong. And the fact that Biran's wearing a thong, remember that. We have to fight for that. We need to get this guy a pair of trousers. I don't care if it's jean shorts, or leggings, or jeans, or office trousers, or even those weird cut-up jeans you used to get in, like, the late 90s. With flashing boots as well. We need to get him a pair of trousers. Sorry, I'm, I'm talking all the way through this Yuna moment of, com of trying to convince the Ronsos. I'm just talking about Bira needing a pair of trousers. Will you accept that Bira needs some trousers? I sure hope so. Even sacrificing yourself. For the fact that Biram needs to get some trousers? Yes! Man, you have like a really bad posture. Wrong. Really bad. Let them pass. Yeah! That's good to know, I guess. Even the mightiest Ronso could not hope to bend. Because Ronso don't know what fire is. Seriously, play a bit of Pokemon. Fire wrecks it. The sacred heights of Gagazet welcome you. Thank you for changing your mind in two minutes. We thank you. Titus I <laughs> love Titus and Walker in the background of sparring. Ah, sparring. Brilliant. Anyway, I'm going to save, I believe. Uh, but I'm going to go for a break here, but the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X, episode number 61, this is going to be like the, the longest epic I've Let's Played so far in my, what, nearly six years or over six years of doing Let's Plays. Yeah. But uh, in the 61st episode, it feels weird getting to the 60s now of Let's Plays, We'll be going to Mount Gagazette. I'll see you then.